So we are out in front of the booth right now with the electric SF swap and the Gen 3. Tyler is currently back here cleaning the E-Ruck. And we're gonna go ahead and put the E-Ruck on the dyno because why not? It's gonna be seriously the quietest dyno run we've <laughs> ever witnessed. So let's get into this. that thing onto the dyno something about how the front forks or something it doesn't fit so we're gonna grab the gen 3 and dyno that instead because the wheel is gonna be a lot easier to tie in so we'll do that instead long story short we weren't actually able to put the e-ruck on the dyno something about the way the front straps down he was nervous about it so we're just gonna go ahead and do the third gen e -crom. it's the same setup and then he can just tie down the front wheel with the ratchet strap it makes it way easier versus the other wheels there's no So we're getting a baseline here. There he is. So is this a rear brake? It is. Yep. Yeah. I'll be curious. And you said to hit the S mode. Yes, so you'll see on the cluster there, it has a one. If you hit S, it'll go to four. Where the P is? Oh, okay, so yep. is the gear indicator now says... Yep, so that's what you want to be in. You got it. Yep. Okay, and what uh, RPM on this gauge would you like to install that? Uh, you can just rev it out. Um, it's good. It's just amperage draw. Alright, you ready? Yep. Just because we are going to demo this, so that saves my battery. Yeah, exactly. Absolutely. Oh, dude, awesome. Thank you, dude. Uh, thank you. What a treat. Woohoo! <laughs> 24. Yeah. That's crazy. I did not think it'd be that high. It was screaming. Well, as soon as he started getting on, I'm like, this is passing 20. <laughs> that was awesome. But the torque value there is probably crazy. Right, huh? 24, of course. But the torque value on those is crazy. I would love to know. You can't measure torque on it just because it's electric. The electric swap just did 24 horse on the dyno as a base tune. 
so stoked with that. That gives us an awesome place to start from. And the torque value there is much, much higher, much higher than what a 24 horsepower would be. Unfortunately, they can't measure it with their dyno, but uh, I'll, we'll figure out how to measure that in the future. So appreciate you guys watching. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.